good uh, evening, everyone. Can you guys hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you, Iza. Thank you, Hatta. Hi, Faris. Hi, Faiz. Fadia and Dinda. Okay. Thank you, Faris. So just like Faris, guys, if you are ready, it would be great if you can open your camera. Jadi boleh ya teman-teman yang udah siap kayak Faris gitu ya. Boleh open cam kayak Miss Ezi sama Miss uh, Masya juga kayak gitu. So, in this lovely evening, uh, here we are again with uh, Miss Masha in English Across Culture um, section. Yeah. And before I introduce the topic, I have some sort of like pantun for you. Pantun? I don't know the English word for pantun. <laughs> so I think it's like Indonesian word, pantun. <laughs> yes, okay. Yeah. Okay, wow. Hi, Dinda. Faiz, Iza. Okay. So are you ready for the pantun? So pantun is, hari Kamis jalan-jalan ke desa. Jangan lupa bawa ikan blibis. English Across Cultures with Marsha is only at Wilson English. Cakep. Okay, cakep. Okay, <laughs> cakep. Okay, great. Yay. So, hopefully we all ready. So, can you all buat yang for those who haven't opened your camera, are you ready? Udah siap? Boleh send reaction dulu ya. Buat mastiin kita semua ada di sini. Okay. Yeah, we'll go up and get. So now I'd like to um, welcome Miss Masha to share a bit about um, our topic for today. Please, Miss Masha, the time is yours. Uh, okay, I will be first today on this lesson. Uh, hello, everybody. Today we will have a discussion about hobbies, and it's very interesting uh, to know about uh, everybody of you, about your hobbies, and um, I will tell you about some special hobbies which uh, we can do in Russia and uh, maybe people can do in other countries when they have snow, when the weather allows to have such hobbies uh, which connected with uh, cold weather, with snow, with ice and everything like this. I will need a uh, visual uh, if we can put it. Can we put? Uh, video on our screens yeah and uh, for example cook read make photos play online games we can uh, do everywhere around the world but uh, uh, in the winter in russia uh, we can have ice fishing skiing skating snowboarding and uh, we can go uh, outside and use a sleigh. Okay, uh, can we put pictures? And uh, then also I will show you my sleigh. Yeah, from here. Yeah. Maybe me uh Miss Lopi takes a while to uh it hasn't shared screen yet, Miss. Yeah. yeah. I, I can see. One second. So you can see uh from the screen, Russia is big, it's very big country, and uh, the weather is depends uh, on uh, the part of Russia. Yeah, we can uh, see the map and on the map you can see the south of Russia and uh, east, west and north part of Russia. Next page. 
e yeah. how winter is looks like in Siberia in yeah and uh, in winter we uh, like ice fishing or we can call it winter fishing uh, so to catch fish firstly you need to do holes in the ice on a frozen lake or in a frozen river it will be fishing through holes in the ice it's our pastime in winter and we have uh, a lot of uh, different kinds of sport games in winter. Oh, for example, skating and skiing. You will see in, yes, next second you will see. Skating. We can rent equipment and skate uh, somewhere on frozen lakes, on frozen rivers. And the same we can do with skiing. We need equipment, we need uh, warm clothes. Uh, we can ski in, uh, in mountains, for example, and uh, snowboard uh, and uh, snowboarding also. Uh, we can do it in mountains, in the forest, in some natural places. Uh, and uh, we can uh, go for a walk with sleigh. Uh, for skiing and skating can be dangerous, but sleigh uh, is, uh, let's say, kind of transportation. <laughs> for children, uh, which is not uh, dangerous. Uh, now you can see ice hockey. In Russia, we also like football, basketball, but ice hockey, it's our traditional uh, sport. And this is, you can see sleigh, uh, how parents can uh, go with their children, one child or several children uh, during summer, when it's snowy, you can see snow and ice on the road, so it's difficult to go by bicycle or, or some other um, kinds of, um, and we can use sleigh. One second, I will show you my sleigh, they are very big. This is sleigh. Here uh, we can put a child and go with him on ice and on uh, snow. And uh, to make it warmer, usually we put a blanket or something like this here. And we can go to the school to kindergarten if it's not far away yeah that is and uh, also we have uh, some activities to do at home when it's cold outside at home we can read books uh, we like to read books and um, our Russian fairy tales, for example, I have a book to show you. This is uh, fairy tales about animals. Yeah, you can see the picture. Fairy tales about animals for small kids. And uh, on uh, your laptop now you can see uh, next pictures about hobbies at home. What can we do at home? Knitting. Yeah. For example, we can make warm mittens and warm gloves or hats uh, or uh, socks, everything we need to make it warmer.
usually uh, maybe we think that uh, it is uh, something knitting is something our grandmoms uh, or moms like to do but now it's becoming popular between young people uh, because uh, we started uh, to like handmade clothes handmade things and uh, something what i can also uh, explain you uh, gloves has uh, Gloves uh, have five fingers, like this is gloves. And knitting uh, are warmer. They made to be warmer, like only two parts. One for thumb and other part for all other fingers. So yeah, this is for uh, autumn and this is for winter because uh, temperature is uh, different so for uh, autumn we can use uh, gloves uh, from leisure for example and for winter we will use gloves from wool gloves or mittens from wool yeah that is <laughs> that's uh, what i wanted to tell you about uh, which is connected with uh, winter and with uh, such kind of weather. And now I uh, wanted to, to listen to you. Yeah, we can also uh, to listen to you about your hobbies and uh, I am sure I will have a lot of questions. <laughs> Okay, thank you so much, Ms. Masha. So yeah, for sharing <laughs> about some uh, pastime in Russia. So wow, we knew there are a lot of things to do like outside or inside the room. And now it's your turn, guys, to uh, share about your pastime activities. So who wants to do it first? Have you decided the order? Udah ada urutannya? Or Miss Ezi can choose? Or Miss <laughs> can choose? Yeah, you can choose. Uh, in Russia, teachers say uh, the forest of hands. The forest, forest of hands. hands. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Then, I think I would like to invite Hatta. Are you ready? And later I will put on the chat, yeah, uh, the, what is it? So you get, you can get ready, not a surprise, but for Hatta, it's surprise. Is it okay, Hatta? Yes. yes. Okay, thank you. Please, the screen is yours. Okay. Hello, my name is Hatta. I'm from Bandung. So I will explain my hobbies today. My hobby is practicing taekwondo so i usually practicing taekwondo for once a week and it's taekwondo is a martial art from korea yes and then when i when i go to the what is this? taekwondo championship i have to use protection to like the other opponents like like this helmet to protect my head and and then this arm protector and then then my leg protector for my for my leg and and I have the, the body protector too. Okay. That's all I can. Uh, can I ask already? Yes. Uh, do you have a teacher or a coach uh, who can help you uh, practice in uh, Taekwondo? Yes, of course. I have. Yes, mm -hmm. I do. Are there uh, many people who like uh, Taekwondo uh, in Bandung? Yes, I think, but not really, not really many people like it. Not really many. Yes. And are there only boys uh, can? Um, no, boys can girl can do it. Also. 
Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, do they have the same equipment? Yes, of course, they have the same mm -hmm. equipment. Okay, and uh, have you ever participated in any competitions? Yes, I do. Uh, so can you tell us more about competitions? What place did you take? Do you have any medals? <laughs> yes, I have get I have get uh the gold medal and I I win the competition and sometimes I lose the competition too and but that's okay yes. it's, it's just a competition yes mm -hmm. uh, was it a competition uh, for Bandung uh, city or was it competition for the region or uh, for, for Indonesia? Not, not for whole Indonesia, but for the whole, what is it? Province. Eh, province. province. Yes, from all Java. So for Pro West Java all only. All. Yes. Ah, West Java. Yes. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh, wish you for the um, winnings uh, and in your hobby and make maybe making this professionally right yes thank you thank big you. applause to you okay yay thank you so much Hata. all the best for the professional uh your career in taekwondo okay now we would like to invite dinda dinda you ready train is yours uh, hello, my name is Dinda. I'm from Bandung. Today, I want to talk about my one of my favorite my ho my hobby that is reading. Uh, my favorite genres are mystery and thriller because it's interesting. <laughs> uh, uh, I wrote some books uh, with title Suicide Not. Uh, the book write, uh, written by Fia Asano and publish, publisher by Nora Books. What is it about this book? What story is about? This book tells about a best friend, namely Karen and Anne, but one day, uh, Anne suicide in her school. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. And the book tells about Karen's journey to find to find um, reason why Anne suicide. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's a very difficult, like a psychological book. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um uh, do you read books in Indonesian language or uh, can you read books in English? Uh, I read books from Indonesian. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, do you have libraries in Indonesia? Ah, no, I don't have. Uh, Miss Ezi, can you help us? Uh, do you have yeah. libraries in Indonesia? Uh, I mean, uh, ada purpose nggak sih di Indonesia? Ada. Oh, oh yes, in Indonesia have a library. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, and because uh, we have a lot of libraries uh, in Russia, and uh, so we can go to the library for children, library for students, and. Um, so the meaning of library, you can take a book, you can read it, and you can uh, give it back. So without uh, shopping. Understand? Without uh, buying. Yeah. You, can, you can rent a book without buying it. Uh, that, uh, so you can read more and more books. Uh, 
Jadi kayak ada purpose yang kita bisa kayak minjem, tapi nggak usah beli buku gitu ya. Sama nggak yeah, sama di Indonesia? Di in Indonesia, have to. Ya. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oke. Okay. So, uh, do you read? Uh, how often do you usually read? Uh, I open books uh, mm-hmm. if I want. Mm-hmm. Okay, <laughs> that is. Uh, so, in your free time, uh, you like reading books. What uh, What else do you like to do in your free time? Yeah, I I like reading books or watching film. Watching films. Uh, what kind of films do you like? Uh, the genre. What kind uh, of uh, films do you like? Fantastic uh, soap opera series. Uh, what kind of films? Yeah, I like a film with a genre mystery and thriller too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mystery movies and also like the thriller. Like, mm-hmm. what are the examples? Can you mention some examples? Yeah. Mm. Uh, do you know uh, Once Upon a Crime? Uh, yes, I know, but I think I didn't watch it. <laughs> uh, uh, it's a genre fantasy, yeah, tapi it, but it's genre fantasy, but I like two. Yeah. Two of them. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, thank you uh, for sharing with us. Big applause to you. Yeah, thank you so much, Dinda. Okay, great. Well then. Okay, now we would like to call Faiz. Are you ready, Faiz? Yes. Uh, you can, uh, the screen is yours. You can open your mic. Um, Faiz, if you have started uh, your voice, your audio, can I hear it? Coba cek lagi. Atau bener kan ya? Gak cuma misalnya yang gak bisa denger. Oh, udah, udah. Oh, udah. Sekarang, nah, that's good. Start. Yes, we can hear you. You can start. Oh. Hello, my name is Muhammad Al Faiz Tiadi. People usually call me Faiz. Now I want to explain what my hobby is. I like playing basketball. Usually I play basketball on Tuesday and Saturday. I like playing basketball because it's fun. Because it's fun. Ah, fun. Okay. Yeah. What else? Yeah. Uh, how long are you going in for basketball? Can you repeat that? Uh, when did you start play basketball? This year, previous year, maybe 10 years ago, I don't know. Three months ago? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Three months ago. Uh, and uh, do you have a teacher for basketball? Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, do you like uh, to play basketball uh, with your friends? Yes. Okay. And uh, do you like uh, to 
take part in uh, in the competitions one day? In October. Uh, no. In October, you will have some competitions. Yes. Uh huh. So, will you play with your team in October? Yeah. Okay. And uh, do you have uh, fans of uh, basketball in your family? Yeah, I do. I have. have. Uh, who is it? Stephen Curry. Uh, this is a uh, famous uh, basketball player uh, which you like, right? Do you, uh, mm, okay, and uh, I was asking you uh, if you uh, have uh, somebody in your family who can support you when you are playing basketball, like who can go to the stadium and support you during the game? Fans who watch, uh, who likes watching basketball. Do you have fans who likes watching in your family? Um, I think okay. Because kurang tertarik sama basket. Oh. So your family members are not interested in basketball. No. You are don't do it. What about your friends? My friends suka banyak, banyak yang suka maksudnya. There are a lot of them who loves basketball. Who loves basketball. That's good. Uh, wish you a good competition in October. Big applause to you. Yeah, all the best for is. Thank, Thank you, you for is. Okay, now we would like to welcome Erlan. Are you ready? Yeah, miss. Uh, hello, my name is Erlan Raina Halafi Azra. I am 13 years old. I'm from Imahi. My hobby is playing chess. I like playing chess in my free time on my phone. Sometimes I'm playing chess with my father. And my father was the first who teach me about chess too. When I'm playing chess with my father, I'm I use this chessboard. I got this chessboard when I'm nine years old. So this chess has been around for four years. I like playing chess because it trains my brain. Thank you. Uh, is it difficult for you to play chess? Uh, sometimes, but sometimes it's difficult, but sometimes it's easy too. It's easy. Uh, who is uh, the most, uh, let's say, dangerous uh, enemy in the chess? Who plays uh, against you um, very smart? Uh, maybe my father. Your father. He is your teacher and uh, he is uh, the most dangerous player with you <laughs> at the yeah. same time. Yeah. yeah. And um, uh, did you participate in any uh, chess competitions? Um, not yet. Not yet. Uh, do you like uh, to play, uh, how to say, um, can you play quickly or do you like to play uh, 
and think long time? Uh, maybe the second I'm play apa? I'm playing with a slow pace. Mm -hmm. Do you like to think uh, about uh, next uh, movements in advance? Ah, uh, yes, always. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite figure in uh, in the chest? Uh, maybe Hikaru Nakamura. The what is it? Oh. Uh, you mean like the um, favorite, uh, like inspiring chess player, right? Is yes. the questions? Yeah. Erlon, maybe yeah. speak louder. The name? Oh, who, uh, who is the most inspiring and motivation person uh, who played chess for you? Maybe Hikaru Nakamura. That's nice uh, that you know um, such names. Uh, thank you very much. A big applause to you. Okay, thank you so much, Erlan. Yes. Okay, the next one we have Franda. Franda, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, please, screen is yours. My name is Pranda Ramesa Kajanga. You can call me Pranda. I like reading novels uh, in my free time. I like any kind of novel. This is one of the novels I have read. It's a romance. It's about a boy and a girl who care on the mist, they, they fan find out that they have many things in common that put them in a romantic relationship. Thank you. Thank you very much for sharing. Uh, if I understand well, you like reading most of all and you like to read novels, right? Yeah. Uh, do you like to discuss uh, novels with your friends uh, after reading new ones? Yes. Uh, yes, and... Uh, do you have uh, a lot of friends with the same hobby? I, I don't get the money. Can you read it? So, yeah. Do you have friends who also love reading novels? Yes, yes. And you get the money to go by channel? Yes. Okay. And uh, what do you like to do in your free time outdoors? Don't like to go anywhere. Uh, do you like to read uh, in Indonesian or uh, in English? Uh, Indonesian. In Indonesian. Uh, do you have a dream to read uh, easily in English one day? Uh, yes, I have. Uh, can you say that learning English is uh, your hobby too? Can you repeat? Can you say uh, that learning English is your hobby too? Yeah. Learning English is your hobby? Uh, yes, it's my hobby. Yes. Uh, 
do you like uh, to get uh, new skills from from learning? Uh, can you repeat it again? Yes. Uh, uh, do you like uh, to get new skills from learning English? Uh, let's say, uh, what do you like uh, most of all in uh, learning English? Uh, I like because uh, English is uh, uh, in the language is interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much and a big applause to you. Thank okay, you. thank you, Brenda. Okay, now we would like to invite Isa. Isa, are you ready? Inshallah. Okay, the screen is yours. Uh, okay, hello everyone, my name is Isa. Uh, today I will tell you about my hobbies. Okay, to be honest, I have a lot of hobbies, but I only will describe my hobbies. Only two that I will like it. So first, I like playing games for my hobbies, like oh, laptop games yeah, in my PC. And also my second hobby is I like to do some sports, like, well, I... I play sports a lot, but my main sports is two, and it's football and also baseball. That's it. Uh, how much time do you usually play uh, football or baseball during? Uh, for football, okay. Uh, for football, I play three times in a week, like. Uh, on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, for baseball, also three, but sometimes I play two because I already have a, a proper schedule for baseball. Mm -hmm. uh, so, uh, do you uh, like uh, team uh, games, uh, prefer team games, or um, alone uh, hobbies? Uh, for some for the sports, I usually play teams mm -hmm. like football and baseball. What is your favorite game? What is your favorite game on your laptop? Uh, if for my favorite game, I don't know if you miss know it, but it's called War Thunder. So the game is like a uh, pvp but we like using some ve vehicles mm -hmm. like some planes or some planes or even ships the same thing mm -hmm. okay and uh, what uh, are another hobbies you said you have a lot of hobbies can you uh, tell a little bit about every of them uh I'm sorry, but can you what? Uh, I'm sorry, but can you repeat it? Yes, uh, you said you have a lot of hobbies. Yes, hobbies. Uh, lap yeah, laptop games, uh, football, and baseball. And uh, can you uh, tell others hobbies? Well, mm, others variants how to spend uh, your free time. Well, in my free time, I usually like i train and home and mm -hmm. little writing activities and if but oh, i also like reading comics yes. mm -hmm. but if i don't all all of them i usually sleep mm -hmm. so i think sleep is also my hobby because i sleep a lot okay okay yeah 
Uh, yeah, yeah, only maybe that's all my hobbies. Also, I like to spend my time with my family and also my brother. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's all. Okay, thank you very much. Big applause to you. Okay, thank you, Isa. And then now uh, it's time for Fadia. Are you ready, Fadia? Yes. Uh, Fadia, can you try? Uh, maybe uh, something with connection or with microphone. Yes, me. Um, uh, now, now, yes. Hello, hello Miss. Uh, my name is Fadia. I'm from Subang. I just want to tell you about my current pastime that I like doing before going to bed. Every night, I watch culinary vlog on Instagram. I enjoy watching it because I like trying to make any kinds of modern food just like French, French fries, pasta carbonara, and many more. I just use my handphone to browse the vlog about culinary on Instagram. That's all from me. Thank you. Uh, I'm sorry. Um, uh, ca can you please repeat? Uh, do you watch uh, culinary blog or do you um, write uh, there? Watch. Just watch. Post, uh, in this uh, I blog. I just in... watch video. Ah, watch videos. Okay. And uh, can you repeat um, the recipe after watching video? Yes. Can you cook it itself, right? Yeah, try. I guess. Uh -huh. uh, you told about carbonara from Italy. Uh, do you have some recipes from Russia to cook it at home? No. No? <laughs> you have to try something like borscht or akroshka or olivia salad to cook it at home. <laughs> What is your favorite Indonesian uh, dish? My favorite is sate. Sate? Yeah. Uh, have you uh, seen video how to cook sate in uh, your favorite uh, culinary blog? Yes. 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 yes? Uh, how was this video? Do you uh, know how to improve this video, to improve this recipe? How to please repeat? Uh, how was uh, this video about sate? Do you want it to improve something, to uh, make it by yourself? No, me. No? It was excellent? I, I cannot make sate. You cannot? Yeah. Uh, who, who usually makes sate in your house? Nobody. No one. No one. No one? No one? Uh, yeah. With whom uh, do you share your hobby? My 
my mom. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you so much. Big applause for yeah, you. Well done. Okay, now we have the last but not least, of course. Yeah, Faris, you ready? Yes, miss. Uh, hello, my name is Faris. I'm 14 years old. I live in Tangerang. My hobby is swimming. I usually swim once a week on Wednesday. I like swimming because uh, because it can make me tall more fast than other guy. Yeah. Do you like to swim in the swimming pool or do you like to swim in the uh, ocean? Both. Two of both. them. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where uh, where is it more difficult to swim? Uh, okay. Is it more difficult yeah. to swim in the ocean or uh, uh, in the, the difficult is on the ocean, yeah. Not difficult. What styles yeah. of swimming uh, do you know? What types of swimming? Uh, uh, the style? Do you know? Types. Yeah. What kinds uh, of them? Can you know stuff. like swimming like this or swimming like this? <laughs> <laughs> this one oh, yes. and yeah that's the frog frog style and this is the freestyle freestyle mm -hmm. uh, do you have a competition from swimmers swimmers i have yeah i have i have two of the medal here wow gold and silver uh the silver one is the second place, and the gold one is one. So uh, you got uh, the faster. Yeah. The faster one. Uh, is it a solo competition or team competition? Uh, solo. Solo competition. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and uh, what do you like? Uh, to do in your free time except of swimming uh i usually play games a lot mm -hmm. or eat and just sleep like that <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, what kind of games uh, you mean sport games or online uh, games online uh, video games yeah online mm -hmm. uh, uh, what is your favorite one uh call of duty Modern Warship and War Thunder. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you very much. Big yeah, applause. Thank you. Me. Okay, thank you so much, Faris. Wow, that's cool. I think uh, everyone has presented and has shared about their hobbies. Yeah. And uh, yeah. If we have time, uh, maybe somebody have uh, has uh, questions uh, for mm -hmm. me, and uh, also in our visual, uh, we can uh, have part about Russian traditional toys. Maybe we can show. Yeah, that's right. I think we still have time. So, guys, uh, previously, uh, Miss uh, Marcia have showed us like something like ice fishing and many more. So if you have any questions about Russia, you can yeah open your mic or raise your hand and ask the questions. Bah ya, kalau ada pertanyaan. Any questions? Or maybe I will ask first question. <laughs> so, okay. Previously, you were that, uh, you know, like the uh, knitting stuff. Did you make it by yourself? Uh, no, my aunt uh, made it by herself uh, and presented it to me. My aunt. Oh, 
Your iPod. That's really, I mean, like, it's really good. It's like a store. And uh, she made uh, the funniest thing that she made the same uh, one, not this one, <laughs> but another one, uh, the same uh, like family look for me and for my son. And she made green for me and green for my son. And uh, we have uh, pictures with the same hats uh, in winter when um, we made a snowman. Wow, that's really nice. Uh, I wonder. It must look good in the family pictures, right? Couple. Yeah, family um, pictures so. in family look uh, um, always looks very nice. <laughs> okay. Yeah, how about the students? Any questions? Hello, mumpung Miss Masha ada nggak tiap hari ketemu? Manfaatkan. Come on, for whom it was difficult to answer my questions? You can uh, do the same and ask me some difficult questions. Oh, yeah, tanya, tanya aja. Ada apa tadi? Sweet, um, ice fishing. Tahu, misalnya mau nanya. Kalau ke Rusia bagusnya kapan gitu ya? Yeah. Kalau mau liburan, coba coba saya ngeris. About <laughs> the children, uh, I will say about children and about adults to just uh, to show something traditional. Uh, so uh, maybe we can start uh, showing. Oh, showing the screen. Yes. Yeah. Oh, the screen. So, so showing the screen and um, uh, any time if you have questions, you can ask. Ah, oh, yeah, Faiz, do you have questions? Oh, enggak. Tadi unmute. Kira -kira ada pertanyaan. Sorry. Yeah. And. Um, do you have any recommendation like the best time to spend holiday in Russia, particularly if you are from Indonesia? Um, yes. Um, if you are from Indonesia, of course, it will be very interesting for you to see snow, to make snowmen, to play snowballs, and it will be very unusual for you to come in winter and uh, in winter it means in december uh, january and february and in december maybe it will be very interesting for you uh, to see a new year's if celebration and christmas celebration uh, because uh, it will be very unusual uh, in uh, uh, in new year's if we have a lot of fireworks and uh, it will be beautiful and very bright. And now on your screen, you can see pictures from our winter, uh, videos from our winter snowflakes and uh, how children play, play uh, snowballs and making snowmen. Uh, when we are making snowmen, uh, we put uh, here a carrot, a carrot instead of his nose. So carrot uh, is nose of snowman. And we can use our hats uh, to put uh, on its um, head. Or for example, we can put uh, a scarf or uh, we can make uh, hands uh, from uh, woods, from wood, uh, from uh, parts of the tree or something like that. So uh, we can make snowmen, snow woman, snow cat, snow dog, or everything <laughs> you can imagine. Oh, this sounds interesting. Well, thank you, Masha. Yeah, we don't have snow in Indonesia, so I believe like winter is the best option. <laughs> yes, okay. it's really interesting. But uh, as for me, I like when it's summer. And uh, mm -hmm. for example, this is uh, how we um, draw uh, winter, how we draw uh, when 
trees uh, has uh, trees uh, have no leaves but uh, covered by snow we usually use white uh, and uh, blue and uh, of course if, if you have opportunity it's better to see all four seasons uh, in Russia winter then spring when all trees uh, are in blossom and everything is green and summer when you can swim and feel like you are in Indonesia uh, at home and uh, autumn autumn is very beautiful also now it's autumn and uh, we have uh, trees like yellow red uh, green uh, brown trees uh, are beautiful like they're in famous paint wow okay yeah, this sounds interesting hopefully who knows yeah you can come and spend a whole year there but yeah anyways uh others got ada pertanyaan no you shy <laughs> Yeah, maybe they are still uh, nervous in asking questions, probably. So I think if there is no further questions, it's time for uh, taking pictures. Uh, so mm -hmm. guys, if you have your, uh, what is it, novels or maybe your chessboard or yeah, your tools, yeah, you can also show it in the camera for taking pictures. So let's go. Can I show? Books? Yeah. Sure, oh, so you can show, show your books. Yeah. Okay. Siap semuanya. Udah. Pictures time. Paris tadi ininya. Medalsnya. Your medals. You want to show it? <laughs> okay. Ready? Paris? Padia? Okay. One, two, three. Okay. One more. Time just a second. Tadi Faiz belum kelihatan. Wait, wait, wait. Show you my collection as well. Okay, ready? Not yet. Sorry, my collections. Uh, Fadia, ready? To Faiz sudah ya. Okay. One, two, three, smile. Okay, great. So yeah, well done everyone for sharing your uh, pastime activities with Marsha. And also thank you so much, Marsha, for like um, yeah, communicating with us, so, like sharing also about the pastime activities in Russia. So yeah, before we end this session, let's all say thank you to Miss Marsha. Yeah, thank you, Miss. Thank let's you, Miss. Group. Thank you, Miss. Yeah, well then. Have a nice. Uh, yeah. Have a nice evening. Have a nice evening, everyone. And yeah, I'll see you when I see you again. Thank you. See you. Bye. See you. Bye.